reach out to you as the week goes on with the same with the same information. I don't expect you to remember any of it. Okay, cool, <laughs> thank you. But and then just for a heads up, currently you are gonna fight six thirty. Six thirty. Oh yeah, you got an easy one. Yeah, that is pretty solid. So we're gonna shuttle you over about three thirty. But yeah. I'll remind you that. And if okay. if somebody misses Wade or you know who knows the well, bout order could hopefully. change. Good night. <laughs> he prays every time we're guys. Nice for cash. That's right. So today is, uh, you know, it's kind of a travel day to Vegas. I went and checked in, so I signed all the posters with my, you know, teammate and friend Andre Feely. Uh, when we fight on the same car, we're undefeated on the West Coast because it is the best coast. And then we worked out. What? That's all. That's, uh, like cold, sorry. No, I like I like all this shit. Like, listen, my you guys will listen to my shit all all week. The same playlist that has been for fucking 15 years. We we got a, a hard push in uh, with the coaches. I'm I'm feeling great. I feel sharp. It's uh it's Tuesday. We're you know about a little less than 60 hours from weigh in, but uh, I'm I'm looking forward to this fight week. I'm looking forward to the fight. I'm looking forward to the fans and all the supporters. The, the atmosphere in Vegas already is insane. The UFC has the best fans in any sport. Uh, so they were all there to greet me and you know I'm signing UFC gloves. I'm signing my cards. Even one of the guys gave me a card that I hadn't seen before. I was like that's a sick card. And he's like oh, I got an extra one. You want it? So of course I had to take it. And uh, man I, I'm just I'm taking it all in you know. I'm gonna get back into the winning column. I'm gonna do what got me to the UFC, what got me to the title fight. And uh, man, this is just a start. I'm like, imagine if we were just regular dudes, right? Working jobs we fucking hated. And they're like, hey, do you wanna go make some good money and hang out with your friends in Vegas for a week? I'm like, what's the catch? Oh, you have to fight someone. That's, like, that's the reward. I get to go do what you love. You can make a bunch of money in Vegas with your friends for a week. It's like, I'm not really sure. I guess I'll do it. I guess I'll do it. And then they're like, wait, yeah. uh, but, like, but if I go in there, like, am I going to get my ass kicked? They're like, no, you're going to beat him up. Like, you're going you're gonna to beat him up, you get a week in Vegas with your friends, and you get paid really good. Like, <laughs> <laughs> hey, how are you doing, guys? How are you? Good, how are you? Long time to see you. Yeah, right? Yeah. 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 Good to see you, brother. See you, too. Your fight gloves right here. Do you want to give those a shot? Put that Those are medium. Yeah, I'll, I'll go with this for now and then. Yeah. With the wrap, sometimes they just don't fit that well. And then, bro, put your corner in Yes. Oh, yeah, we got him right there. Okay. Turn the on. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's dope. That little part looks cool. It's clean. Yeah, it is nice. I'm doing it. Yeah, so today's Wednesday, and uh, head over to the Apex just to do, you know, media day. I have to check in with, a, do some uh, video shoots, some uh, photo shoots, talk to the media about the fight, just standard stuff. This fight week is, man, it's much better for me just because usually Wednesday and Thursday, my day is completely packed from morning till evening, and uh, I really just have today to, to fit in a ton of things. Thursday is the first time I have a, a day off, and so I can really focus on the weight cut just because we are getting closer to um, weigh-ins. And then Saturday night, you know, I, I get to go out there and shine and, and show the world that, you know, all the hard work, work that I've put in to this camp, all the hard work my, my coaches have sacrificed their time and, and put into me and invested in me. It's like, we're gonna go out there, we're gonna have some fun, we're gonna put on a show, you know, we're gonna get this, uh, you know, title assembly back intact. Uh, go get our hand raised first and then uh, see what's next. Um, so it's fight week and, you know, it's all about pretty much the weight cut and just fine tuning little techniques and game planning for the fight. Josh is feeling, he's looking amazing. Everything's right on schedule. And it's all about fine tuning. We can't change much right now this close to the fight. We're just making small adjustments for the opponent change. And you know, I'm excited, you know, for, for Josh to show showcase what he's been learning, his improvement, and to get out there and get this W on Saturday. Um, tonight we're about to roll a little bit. Um, probably roll 30 minutes to an hour, depending, uh, you know, how much how much sweat we get going. And we're just, you know, nothing too crazy. 
We're just going through the motions and uh, technique and just making sure we're sharp for Saturday. It's all about time, nothing else, no worries, just moving, sweating, everything is great. Last, yeah, last workout for you. I like it. Uh, just starting with the final weight cut for Josh and uh, everything's on schedule, going to plan and fun begins. Uh, it's not too different. The only thing different is that we have the best nutritionists in the world, perfecting athletes running the show for us. But just um, you properly hydrate them and then you take the water out. You're doing a bath to take it out for the last few pounds. And you know, some guys jump in the sauna, a lot of guys take a bath, a lot of guys, you know, work out. But no, not, nothing crazy. Just everything done right, you know, the proper way with perfecting athletes, you know, running, running it. What kind of discipline does it take? Just sitting there in the heat, sweat, get all that hydration out of you. What was that kind of like as a fighter? You know, if it was easy, everybody would do it. So, and that's why these guys are exceptional people, exceptional individuals, and you know, it takes a special person to be able to do something like this. Starting to get down to the nitty gritty of the cut. Almost finished. Yeah, yeah, this is, man, this is the last bit of the cut. Um, you know, I lost about five. Um, I plan on doing the last, you know, pound or so. I'm just, it's, it's 7.40, so as soon as I'm done with this, I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, I mean, shower, dry off, and then uh, I'm gonna go downstairs so I can check my weight so the UFC staff can see that I'm on weight. And then straight from there, I'm going to the apex early. Weigh-ins are from 9 to 11, but I always like to be the first on the scale. So I'm going to go over there at like 8.15 uh, and, and get ready and then be right on the scale. And then I'm off to the fun part, you know. I get to eat, I get to drink, I get to relax, hang out with my friends, family, coaches, uh, you know, my team. And uh, yeah, we just kind of enjoy ourselves. Uh, good energy, no stress. The hard work is over. And... Uh, then tomorrow night, man, it's time to shine.